The first time I ever saw Michael Jordan Damn. Was in 1981. I wonder how old Chris Mullins. Game. It's Chris Mullins. I wonder how old he is now. He was different. Every practice session was like game seven. And he did that relentlessly every single session. Okay, he's dominated. Okay, we get it. He's the, he's the goat. He's the greatest. He's the greatest. But I'm going to go ahead and Known by do my thing. The basketball capital of the world, Indiana. Is a fitting home for our contest tonight. To the exhibition Ooh. game. The starting line at 14 USA. A six. Welcome everyone, Kevin Harlan, along with Clark yes. Kellogg and Coach Mike Fratello and David Oliver. Now we gotta go up and get signs. Yeah, Thomas and Larry Bird. Well, Larry's not gonna be a problem for real, for real. Going head to head with the team of NBA stars. You could understand the excitement in this building. And it's easy to see why some of the best collegiate athletes in the nation on Team USA. Hey, look at that. Well, the hey, NBA that. Star Squad is just stacked up with their top-tier talent. Now, this game, Clark, only an exhibition contest. But the fans, my goodness, they seem pretty invested already. And I can see why, Kevin. What a sight to behold. I mean, this might even be a once-in-a-lifetime a assemblage of talent. Aguirre, Aguirre, what kind of name is Aguirre? Chris. This many big name players on one Lay up. Court. I am so glad you and I are here to see it. Michael Out there for Team USA, we've got Steve Alford and Michael Jordan at the one and two. Then Chris Mullen at the small four. Raymond Tisdale at power four. Come on, Down bro. <laughs> And out there for the NBA stars, Isaiah Thomas is running things at the point. With Jim Paxson and Mark Aguirre at the two and three. And then it's teammates Larry Bird and Robert Parrish filling out the front court. We know this game doesn't go on anybody's record. But you can tell these players aren't about to come out here and just make each other look good. I think that speaks to the quality of the players Damn. on these two squads. These are all true competitors. Inside... Inside, that's gonna be a travel. That was gonna say, I ain't touching. Now, Team USA with it. Here's Alford on the wing, Mullen. Tisdale passes to Jordan. Michael Jordan attacking Oof, right away. I was about to say. Looking to get something going here. Using his tremendous strength and body control. Jordan shrugs off the contact and gets the shot to fall. Here's Thomas. That's tipped. And he gets it back. Wow, Bird came out ready to play, didn't he? Giving Team USA all he's got on the offensive end. Jordan against Paxson. Over to the left wing. Alford passes to Tisdale. They get a hand on it, and it's out of bounds. Team USA able to retain possession here. Over oh, here, reaching me, damn it. <laughs> Stop it. Here's Jordan. One guy we're going to keep a close eye on tonight, Mike, and this one me is Michael Jordan. Out of North Carolina with a ton of promise. And everyone wants to see how he measures up against real pros. But well, he can make that okay. Right here on here. Um, bro. Well, Thomas is no stranger to physical play. He'll find a way to get his shot. And plenty of storylines to cover, but our sideline reporter David Aldridge, as usual, is all over. David. Thanks very much. Now everyone knows these are just exhibition games, but neither the Olympic team nor the NBA stars have any intention of taking it easy on one another. The tone seems to be surprisingly serious among these players. Guys, back to you. Well, that's going to be interesting, David. Thank you. I don't know what to expect from tonight's game, Mike. It's, it's going to be fascinating to watch. To me, that comes as no surprise. No matter the consequences of your game, you always want to play. Hey, man. It's no family. Clark, there's so much to be excited about watching this unique matchup. But the biggest question is the most obvious one. And that's who's going to win this game. Look, I don't want to be a guy that fudges on picks, but it could be. No, ain't no, 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 no
uh, 2K is known for un uh, uncalled for shit, but that shit, no, definitely uncalled for. Excuse me. Yes, they do. Yep, it counts. You know, one of the major offensive weapons out there for Team USA is Michael Jordan. He plays and scores at a very, very high level and could maybe give some of these NBA stars a run for the money. We know he's competitive, and he's certainly going to try to prove a little something out there, that's for sure. Well, Jordan is also special because he's fun to watch. Once he takes that first step to go on the attack, you can't take your eyes off of him. He's a remarkable young talent. Here's Thomas. It's rebounded by no. Perkins. No. Rebounded by Perkins, something he's become very good at while at UNC. The two free throws coming up, and they're going to stop fouling. Be special to you, Larry. Defender there. Put him in a pickle. Jordan drives with such force, so it's not surprising he's able to draw the foul. And the Stars going with a whole new group out there now. Team USA also making some changes. Patrick Ewing's checked in for Perkins. Turner comes in for Chisdale. And Person subbed in for Mullen. Whitman passes to Williams. Here is Seasting. He's defended by Jordan. Pass to Whitman. Here's Seasting. It's all in no. by Team USA. Right away, you're impressed by the play of Team USA. This squad may be my boy. That's great. But all of these guys are at or close to a true NBA skill level. Mike, I don't think there's any question about it. Some of these guys are definitely going to leave the summer games headed to the league. So you do expect them to be playing at close to a pro level even now. But I have to agree with you. This just isn't some scrappy university team we're looking at. Seasting passes to Williams. McHale right side. What you got, Kevin? Pass to Whitman. Williams inside. He's guarded by Ewing. We right here. Especially Pat. Time and go up for the rejection. Ewing is trying to extend this lead. Actually, they're doing more than trying because the lead is growing. This is a key part of the game. They're trying to get some breathing room. Seasting passes to Whitman. Pass to Reed. The pass to Seasting to the right side. Here's Reed. Pass to McHale to end the cold streak. That one's off. The He's cold the streak the continues. The defense wasn't horrible, but Excuse still. He's me. Through there. It wasn't enough resistance to prevent him from scoring that one. Early on, they built this lead on the power Give me this. of paint points. Being aggressive in the paint can take a team out of a game early. And he drives in. NBA stars. And my boy falling. A great dunk by Jordan. So coach, with the start of this game behind us, right now, it's Team USA who's out on top. I'm sure this has not been the start the NBA stars were expecting. But Team USA came out swinging, and right now, they're in control. They desperately need something to fall. Well, they're on the wrong side of the big run. Never a good feeling. Team Excuse USA me. He's swinging together a decent run here while the NBA stars try to break a cold streak. The NBA stars trail by Excuse 14. me. Am I about to take this? Of course. To the inside. Uh, no. To the left wing. No, that's a no no. And the rebound goes to McHale. Things just haven't come together, Mike, for them in these last couple possessions. I think they need to slow down and wait for the right That's shot, a high percentage, percentage shot. Mm -hmm. When you're struggling to get ahead, a mistake like that is doubly damaging. Absolutely the wrong time for that kind of slip up. I agree, it just destroys your momentum. And the Stars going with a whole new group out there now. And Team USA making a change here as well. Mullins check in for person. Mike, we're pretty far into this game. How do you like what you've seen so far of Michael Jordan? I gotta say, I'm impressed. Mm. He's playing against some of the country's best pros and making a real impact out there. What a talent. I got yours, I got yours. Bird outside. Goes up and lays it nice and easy. And Bird is just you think you, you think you a big man, ain't you? You think you a big man, huh, Bird? 
You reaching me for boy? Substitution on the court. Parrish against Ewing. Passes it to Alford. Here's Mullen. Ewing trying to get open. Mullen shot is off. We're not gonna talk about the fact. Um, Here's Thomas. You gonna stop giving. You gonna stop giving him that. <laughs> Don't be fooled by his size and that smile. Thomas is as tough as nails and as feisty a competitor as you'll see. A big part of Team USA strategy has to be making the NBA stars earn their looks. Nothing easy. If they give up quality shots, you know these pros are going to knock them down. So they've got to. Never mind the fact that y'all just both jump me. Never mind. That's a corner. Come on now. Don't be doing that. Okay, you're going to stop giving me PDs. Why he look like that? Outworking the pros might just be the key. Team USA is full of Let's make drag this face into some so in a pavement. On that end could be the difference maker. Quite simply, he's automatic at the line. And with a decent amount of this game already gone, Michael Jordan has been coach just superb on offense. Yeah, this NBA star squad has not been able to shut him down. And he's outpacing Larry Bird in terms of scoring because of it. Can you believe what you just said? Outpacing Larry Bird. Man, it's amazing. That's saying a lot. And yeah, what? Those were two gritty points for Mullen. The NBA stars trail by 11. Something that's really making this game special is this crowd. I'm told it's over 60,000 people packed in here to see Team USA take on the NBA star. No. Boy, much respect for the defense of Jordan. I mean, he gives his all. Why'd you go in front of him? I mean, fantastic at getting his hands up to block shots. Never mind Excellent the fact that the these are foul layups. But you're going to give him that. I guess. Many are salivating for this matchup. And I'm sure there are plenty of you folks at home who couldn't be here in person. But you're making just as much noise as these fans are. Oh, you ain't just not, you're just not going to activate your takeover like it's all hunky dory. Go to David Aldridge and see what he's picking up on the sideline. Thank you, Kevin. Now, I have found something that both teams' coaches agree on. They think that these games are the best possible way to prepare the Olympic team for international competition. Oh, NBA lost. stars are among, if not the, best players in the world. So who better to challenge you? Oh, my goodness. That ain't going to be together. a scapegoat. Back to you guys. That's a good point. Thanks for that, DA. Clark, any thoughts on these coaches' assessment? Well, no, no, I'm no, about to do it. I mean, there's no way you can't agree with the plan against the top talent. Why did he run in? Why did you run in? Develop your own game and grow as a player. You know the old saying, iron sharpens iron. He's still going to give it to him. Man, no. Oh, All right, Where Jordan Brown, bro. You about to. exciting rising stars there are on this Team USA roster. Bruh. Dynamic college athletes. Many of whom already have big NBA expectations attached to them. For the stars. Y'all not going to do this Harris. shit to me. Mikael comes in for Aguirre. And Woodson subbed in for Paxson. And Team USA making a change here as well. Why is, is why is the jump shot so slow? In this quarter because clearly his jumper is not going down right now. Guys like Perkins and Jordan and Ewan. Oh my goodness, no, fuck all that. I just love how y'all try to jump me with... He has a particular set love how y'all try to jump me with the quickness. Bird outside. Outside Thomas. Ashton Woodson pulls up. I'm right here. Good I saw him right Jordan. here. Team USA leading by three. Down low. Stolen by Bird. Bruh. That it really even hit? That really even. That was really even stolen by Bird. Outside Thomas. 
It's blocked. Stars able to keep the ball here as it goes out of bounds. Substitution on the court. Six seconds left here in the first half. Three seconds left. Does I'm gonna say I am right ball. here. Mm -hmm. Well, you've got to be there defensively. I mean, that's an easy mid-range. So that'll be it for the first half. Fairly even battle underway in this one. Bird is out there with Aguirre. Then it's Thomas. Then it's Parrish. And it's Paxson in at the shooting guard position. So that's the group out there right now for the Stars. What stood out to me after a full first half of play is the sense of competition out there on the floor. The NBA Stars aren't handling Team USA with kid gloves. They're giving their all. Here's Paxson. And it's no, with the right here. Perkins got four rebounds in this game. Mullen against Parrish. Michael Jordan on the wing. He feeds it to Perkins. Bucket is good. It's a mismatch. It's a mismatch. And Clark with Team USA, they don't seem to be holding anything back. Without question, if, if these young guys are intimidated by playing against pros, they're not showing any signs of that. And you know, it's not so easy to have to go Come up on, Nick. Uh, nigga is right there. Come on. That takes a lot of confidence. A lot of guts. You're right. Got you. Here's Tisdale. And one. Good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. One half gone, coach. You have to admit, Jordan has looked good matched up against some of these NBA stars. Oh, absolutely. He's attacking when he wants and finding himself shots. Showing no fear against some talented NBA defenders. Aguirre passes to Bird. That one no, he is right here. USA leading by eight. To the middle. Here's Mullen. And one. Basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. Good job staying with the shot. Mullen isn't going to be pushed around out there. He's a lot stronger than he looks. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. And so Thomas will bring it up for the NBA Stars. The pass to Paxson. Thomas surveying the D. Back to Paxson. The shot. I'm right here. It's hauled in by Team USA. Perkins got five rebounds tonight. So, Coach Vitello, as we get the second half going here, it's Team USA holding on to the lead. The problem is that might only further motivate the NBA stars. Gotcha. Being down to amateur players at this point in the game will really fire up their competitive spirit. That's going to be fun to watch. Make joint pass this Here's time Thomas around. I think maybe switch the wrong person. Could be riveting. Points. The quickness of Thomas, it really helps him penetrate. Paxson against Jordan. Out to the right wing. Pass to Alford. He dishes it to Perkins. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. You gotta love strong defense, especially when it comes especially to the if form they of jump Jordan. Wow. Stop it. An emphatic Stop projection it. that was. Boy, you've got to appreciate that kind of forceful in your face defense. So it's the stars now. The stars Get out of here with that. Thomas passes to Baxter. Shot from free throw range. No. The rebound by Mullen. We are most definitely this right here. That all of these players have to deal with. Playing with the coach they're not quite familiar with. Now you go home, me. That can be more challenging than it seems when you haven't had a lot of practice time to build up a relationship there. And there's the whistle. Three second violation. So for the Stars, second on who? Kale's checked in for Burke. Reed comes in for Aguirre, and it's Whitman in for Baxter. Team USA also making some changes. Ewing comes in for Sam Perkins. And Concac is subbed in for Tisdale. Here's Reed. And they'll get another chance. Harris drops it in from 14 feet away. Can Robert Harris even shoot? Single digits for the Stars. Jordan against Whitman. To the left side wing. Outside for Jordan. 
the wing, Ewing. That shot is off. Y'all don't, so don't even try to go. Y'all don't even try to contest in it. This, I've always thought it's an interesting dynamic when players have a new or temporary coach in control. It's really all We're going to stop giving him these fouls. You have to respect what the judge is trying to do. giving him these fouls, so bro. You have to respect that the players are fully accustomed to your style and be patient with them. Sounds like communication key. The Stars making a switch here. Williams has checked in. Tisdale, he's checked in for Team USA. Here is Jordan. 21 points in the game. Stolen by Reed. I press X. Whitman. That should be a deflect right here. It is. In some ways, this game between Team USA and the NBA stars is a good game. playing with him. And the high flying antics of Jordan simply off. Awesome. A lot of this game already in the books, and offensively, coach Michael Jordan has been putting on a show, finding shot after shot after shot. And taking a big scoring lead over Larry Bird. I really think this NBA Stars unit was just unprepared for Jordan. Maybe they thought an amateur would be easy to guard. Maybe they did. I don't know. It has been interesting, though, had Flyering on all cylinders right now. Jordan is showing no mercy and getting any shot he wants. Thomas passes to Reed. Here's Whitman, guarded by Jordan. Passes it to Whitman. Just shot that Thomas. Just shot that Isaiah Thomas. Outside, Mikhail. Fires from the line. Williams kicks to Reed. Goes up again. Outside for Thomas. Bro, come on. Thomas trying to break loose. Bro, come the fuck on. He's cut down now to just seven on the bucket for McHale. Jordan dishes the mullet. Back to Jordan. Oh, in the chair. Excuse me. Give the assist to Mullen. Chris has great court awareness. Now, here's Thomas. Tight defense on him. Pass to Reed. And it's off the back rim, no good. Mullen passes to Ewing. Good on the bucket. And it's an 11 point Team USA lead. This is why Ewing's teammates feed him down low there. They know how lethal he is inside. Well, most of this game behind us now, and all you can say about Michael Jordan's performance, Mike Fratello is wow. I mean, what a show. He is put on against these NBA stars. He certainly does look league ready, doesn't he? Oof. You can just see why fans are so excited about Jordan's potential as part of an NBA team. I mean, he's got everything. McHale kicks to Thomas. Back to Reed. Step back shot. It'll go when the team get the fuck out of here, bro. No, a nigga was literally on him. A competitor every moment he's on the floor. Thomas not allowing an empty possession there. And Jordan slams it home. You must applaud what Michael Jordan has done in this game. He certainly hasn't looked like an amateur. He's looked like a pro. And so, coach, it's Team USA currently in the lead with most of this game now. This shouldn't even be a pass. It should be a turnover. The young guys of Team USA for being in this position, but they can't take Chris got his take. See what you got. See what you got, Chris. Hood green. And that one good. And Team USA leads by 11. Here's Thomas. And there's the pass to Reed. Now Williams. This is a mismatch. Mikhail trying to free himself. Shots good by Williams. Close range, high percentage looks will never go out of style. That's just strong fundamental basketball. Let's it go from the wing. The shot's good from Mullen. Chris Mullen. And here's Thomas who brings it up for the stars. They trail by 11.
Pass to Williams. The nine foot shot outside for Thomas. Let that shit go out, bruh. Let bounds. that go out. <laughs> they say it was touch by Williams. So the ball is sailing out of bounds. Not the offensive possession they were hoping for. And Team USA making a change. And one. Hawkins has checked in. You know, every player wants to win a game they're playing in. But in this matchup, there's some extra pride. That's crazy. It's, it's, it's one point where it's slow. It's another point where it's like, fast. Wants to show us they're ready for the lead. They even tried to jump for real. What they need right now is points. That's right, Clark. He just wanted to make that was going straight to me. But no reason not to put some power behind them. Let the defense know you're coming for them. Here's Paxson and Jordan. Yes, they're gone. But they all niggas don't try and jump. Jordan's Jordan passes to Alford. Perfect on the shot, swishes it through. And Team USA leads by seven. Alford's gone two for four so far here tonight. Yes. Pass to Tisdale. This will blow. Oh, now Tisdale you give him a foul. So a chance here for a three-point play. I have no idea how he made it. Somehow powering through the foul and converting. Flexing on the D a little there. Let's see if he's able to come through with the strike. Isaiah Thomas checked in for C Stink. And Team USA making a change here as well. Ewing's checked in for Sam Pass. Oh, uh, Clark, they've just about closed the door on this one. All they've got to do now is squeeze the orange and, and milk that clock. And this run has helped seal the win. Give them credit for executing down the stretch. Nice work. Get up on Thomas! Outside Thomas. There's the pass to Bird. To stop the run. Right here. Kept alive. Parrish. That's off. And another shot. And Bird finishes. They're going to keep giving them these. Start what he can to make it clear who the pros are. Giving the NBA stars a boost with his offensive production. Jordan, the pass to Mullen. And the shot goes down. Any night Molly's playing, you expect big point totals from him. Chris is that good. Here's Thomas. And he overshot that one, missing. Floats one. And that's collected by... Where's the foul? Where's the foul? Where's the foul? Where's the foul? Jackson outside. And so it's Team USA who is able to capture a win over the...